This is the Geneva Shore Report coming to you from the beach in downtown Lake Geneva with the Riviera Pier District just in the in the distance, the building over there. You can see the workers on top of it and the red roof continues to envelop the top of it. Pretty soon it will be all of that and it'll be very nice looking. The lake continues to thaw at a fairly rapid rate and that's gonna increase tomorrow and Sunday. So stay off the lake. It's very dangerous ice out there too thin. Anyway, I am here on... It is Friday afternoon of March 6, 2020. I'm Jen Lovkowski. And George Belushi Jr. And the Geneva Shore Report. Good afternoon. And yes, we are here for the weather and news update. And yes, stay off the ice. We have some very warm temperatures in our future. I have a feeling it's going to be completely thawed out here pretty soon. Today, we have 36 degrees and the winds are not as bad as anticipated. So it feels pretty close to the 36 without the breeze and that sunshine is very warm. But when the breeze does pick up, it's out of the north and it's averaging about 10 miles an hour. So, but tonight, severe calm winds, a low of 24 and tomorrow we have 51 degrees and full sunshine and calm winds again. So it's going to be a great weekend by Sunday, 60s, low 60 degrees with some more sunshine. So, and next week we have all 50s for the entire week, mid to low 50s. So definitely ice fishing is done. The season I think is over. So we have a lot to look forward to though. We have a lot going on this weekend. Tomorrow we have a double grand opening over at Fancy Fair Mall with scented and chic and unique consignment boutique. Best friends op opened their stores together. It was all planned. Double grand opening tomorrow and Sunday all weekend. They're gonna have goodies and giveaways and trivia questions for some good discounts and sales and treats. So it'll be fun to stop in there and welcome them to Lake Geneva. And also in Fancy Fair Mall, it should be opening soon, is the farm stand. All organic and natural products, kind of like going to a farmer's market. A nice little farm stand so it'll be fun to see them opening here shortly and then we have the CBD store over on Center Street by Dust Bunny Bucks the old karate place used to be in there for a month or two and it's everything CBD and they're hoping to be open by the end of the month so they're moving along quick over there they're really uh, making a lot of progress and tomorrow we have some fun activities over at Home Depot nine to noon they have their free kids workshop and the kids get a little apron and a little pin and their tools and they get to make a craft it's a lot of fun they get always a good turnout over there so they do ask that you register online ahead of time if possible but they will take walk-ins and tomorrow night united way has a fundraiser over at the elkhorn high school in the auditorium it's for all of walworth county and different dance groups from around the county are going to be dancing and putting on a show. Tickets are $12 at the door and then all of that money goes back to United Way. So it's a nice little fun fundraiser they're doing over there. Other than that, we're going to have great weather, good weekend to get out and shop and check out the good sales and activities going on in downtown Lake Geneva. A lot to uh, check out this weekend and hopefully everyone can get out and enjoy the weather. I think that's all we've got. So I'm John Lovkowski. And George Belushi Jr. And the Geneva Shore Report. Good Bye. afternoon.